Hello, today we're going to be going over how to add Google Analytics to your website. This is another tutorial provided by Compete Now, WordPress and eMarketing tutorials to give you the keys to our presence, putting the fast thing to success. Plenty more on our website. Uh, you can go subscribe for alerts for our new tutorials there, or you can subscribe to this channel uh, for new tutorials. That will get started. Um, first, you're going to want to log into your uh, back end. We're going to be using a plugin for this. <clears throat> you can also check your theme. Some themes have special sections for Google Analytics, others don't. Um, but either way, you can go and hit Add New and go to Plugins. We're going to do Ultimate Google Analytics. Search Ultimate Google Analytics, or I also put a link in the description where you can download it directly and upload it to your site uh, either way. All right, so you're just going to install that and activate it. I already have it installed. Um, I'm going to go down. Now, once you install it, you can go to the left, go down, and you'll see Settings, and then you'll see Ultimate Google Analytics. All right, and then the account ID, it'll be UA and then a bunch of X's. Um, I'll show you how to also go over to Google and uh, get that set up so that you have a, the value for this. So you're going to go to Google. It's Google Analytics. All right. Here's the web page for Google, Google Analytics. You're going to want to sign in with the Google account that you want to um, you want to set up Google Analytics. So sign in, or you might have to create an account either way. So hurry, first you do sign in. Compete now tutorials. All right. And since you don't have any other profiles, you're going to just hit sign up. All right. The account name. Uh, compete now tutorials and you're gonna put in the URL pick the extension and we'll do compete now. okay pick your time zone so you're gonna put in your website URL here um, why not add in the www dot that's how it is in the example so Share my Google. So if you use AdWords, you're going to want to say yes. But uh, here, I always just uncheck it. I mean, I don't know. Share share the data with less people, I guess, if possible. <laughs> um, terms and conditions, uh, of course, you agree. <laughs> Create account. All right. So it's not installed yet, but um, you know, single do single domain. Um, this is the script that you would need, but the way that we're doing it, you don't really need this script. You just need this UA number. So just copy that where it says tracking ID. Go back to your ultimate Google Analytics settings, paste over that, paste it in, and hit update options. And that's it. It's all set up. You can go down, and you can hit just save, and it's just going to take. It's just going to take about a day or so to start seeing the data, but that's all set up and ready to go. Now, if you um, if you already have a Google Analytics account and you want to add a, a website to your tracking, uh, let's I'll quickly go over that as well. Um, I kind of had covered it in my last tutorial, but with the whole new version of Analytics, um, it's all different. So we're going to go up to Admin. You just click on Admin. All right, and you'll see your um, You'll see everything here, and what you want to do is you're going to want to create a new profile, which is on the left. Okay, and let's see, get this drop down, do the accounts list. Okay, and you'll see that all accounts list. As you can see, this is different for everybody, because, but at least I can show you how to do it when you have a new account. Okay. Alright, so finally you just hit admin and then add a new account. Alright, 
here it is right here new account so same same process it just brings you to you pick the name of the account you pick the URL and you go through the same thing and then you'll have multiple accounts now uh, even quicker I'm gonna go over how to add uh, users to your um, new user say you want to share the the data with another person that is in your company and um, you know you don't want to give them the password to your Google account but you still want them to have access what you're gonna do is go to admin and you're gonna do um, you're going to click on the the list for the the compete now put, click on the um, the one that you want then go to users all right so this is the one that's on there now that's that'll be you you do add new user and you put in their email address so if I wanted to put in whatever their email address is um, right here will be all the websites that are currently on here since I only have one but if you have multiple, you do you click the one you want and you hit add. You can hit multiple ones also. You can make them a, a user where they can just view everything. You can make them an administrator where they'll be able to do pretty much anything you would be able to do. And then you hit create user, and that will give them access. And then all they have to do is log into Google Analytics, and they will see your, your that profile that you would assign them to. All right. So this is another tutorial provided by Compete Now WordPress and e-marketing tutorials give you the keys to web presence, put you in fast success. Uh, play more on our website at startcompete.com/tutorials.